So today I wanted to bring you an online lesson. You can sort of tell the differences between these two. So what I've done here is with this client, we've drawn a line on his head. So when he came in, as he was going to the top, we can tell that he has a lot of weight still over on this left side. So we can see he's really wanting to lean and load early. Then as he starts down, because so much of that weight is already over on that left, he's going to continue to drive, but at some point has to back out of the shot. And we can see how much his head has kicked back on this. And this is causing a lot of inconsistencies being able to control that club face. So we're really getting it out. Um, he's hitting a lot of big hooks, but then would turn around and have massive blocks as well. So that was one of the first things that we wanted to try and clean up. After a little bit of progress and getting through, this will be a practice swing over on the right now. We can tell he's much more loaded into this right side, nice and straight up and through here. He's up to 84%. As he starts down, we can see that head wanting to drive through the line. And he continues to rotate and near impact, he'd still be touching. So yes, a little bit more weight over on that left than we would like, but again, really trying to get him to establish a good feeling so that he can rotate through with that body, control that club face much easier, so I don't have to worry about timing it with the hands. So something to definitely look for in your swing and really try to make sure that you're loading into the right, but then getting over to that left as well.